Hello. Today, we came to see the Widespan Mulcher MM7000. As you know, Bednar brand is especially known for its soil cultivation and seeding machines. However, since 2005, the Bednar product portfolio also includes large area rotary cutters of the MZ model series. The cutters have three rotors, but the flagship cutter, MM7000, has five rotors. The Bednar brand has focused on manufacturing large rotary cutters from the very beginning. They are rotary cutters with a horizontal rotational axis. We do not manufacture the standard hammer cutters. The reason is simple. Large area cutters offer a larger area capacity at a lower fuel consumption and lower demands on tractor power. Rotary cutters are becoming increasingly more popular among farmers. The main reason behind that is the continuous pressure from legislative authorities on reducing the use of agents for chemical protection of plants. The rotary cutter is a suitable tool for mechanical weeding as well as for eliminating various pests such as the European corn borer in corn after harvest. This is the front part of the Mulcher MM7000. We offer two types of drawbar for the cutters. One option is a drawbar connected to the bottom or top hitch. As far as the hitch is concerned, we have a 40 or 50 mm eye or the K80 hitch. Bednar rotary cutters can be equipped with two types of cardan, manufactured either by Bondioli or Walterscheid. The gearbox drive uses a cardan connected to the tractor, which can be equipped either with 20, 21 or 6 grooves according to the type of the PTO shaft. When mulching, especially permanent grassland, pastures, tall grass or crop residue after grain corn or maize, the material is quite aggressive and can have a negative impact on the machine frame. Therefore, all Bednar rotary cutters, both MZ and MM series, have the entire machine frame hot-dipped galvanized to increase its resistance to aggressive plant uses. The machine is transported using the transport axle that can also be used to set the machine height during work in the field. In this case, the MM series rotary cutter has a central walking axle. It means that one wheel is always offset. That guarantees better terrain tracing and machine leveling during work. There is a pair of wheels on each of the side frames as well. The individual wheels can also be rubber filled. It increases the resistance of the machine tires to puncture when working in extreme conditions. The working height of the cutter is set hydraulically. There are the hydraulic cylinders. The hydraulic cylinders are both on the side frames and on the central transport axle. The work height is simply adjusted using a hydro clips. The height of mulching is set by the number of hydro clips used. There is one interesting technical solution that all Bednar rotary cutters have, the friction clutch. The friction clutch automatically stops all the gear processes in case of a sudden impact of the machine with an obstacle that could damage the rotor. All cardan connecting the individual rotors are equipped with a friction clutch. Rotors are the main parts of the machine. As you can see, the MM7000 machine has five rotors, one central and two rotors on each side frame. In this case, the rotors are equipped with grass blades, but they can also be equipped with a special set for mulching crop residue after harvesting corn for grain or maize, using special corn blades. Each machine can be fitted with optional equipment on request. This particular one includes spreading deflectors, which is especially handy when mulching grass not grazed in meadows or permanent grassland. The spreading deflectors prevent the formation of lines after the rotors. Armoring is also available. Armoring is an important part of the rotary cutter as it protects the rotor area and increases the durability and resistance of the machine to punctures caused by rocks or other sharp objects. The widespan rotary cutter is primarily designed for mulching large areas. However, if you have land with a smaller slope on the edge or a ditch, you can adjust the machine to work on such land by easily changing the settings with the side frame hydraulics. The side frames, right or left, can be adjusted from minus 15 to plus 45 degrees. Other optional equipment of Mulcher MM7000 includes frame cover plates. They are yellow plates used for easier removal of crop residue or grass matter after the completion of work. And the trash fan device that creates a stream of air is the top equipment of the machine. Air is directed to the central and side frames using flaps to allow for continuous cleaning of the machine during work. There are runners on the sides of the central and side frames. The skid shoes guide the machine through the terrain and maintain the minimum working height. Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like more information about this machine, visit the Bednar website where you can find the detailed product page.
If interested in more information, contact your authorized Bednar dealer or try our open Bednar configurator where you can see the individual parts of the equipment online.